I sealed it all around. Hello everyone, welcome to A Foreigner Farming in the Philippines. We're back over at Mitch's and we're going to take a look at his uh, cold room for his uh, meat uh, smoking operation. Yeah, go in. There we go. Oh, I get the, I get the real radio voice in here. Nice and cool. See, I sealed all that all around. Sealed all around the roof, yeah. Yeah, all around the roof so I can finish that when I get the posts. Yeah, out. So it's holding, still holding the. Very nice. You set all these blocks yourself, or you have somebody else do it? He helped me. He yeah, helped right. you? Yeah, the wood, the work. Huh? But we did together, we done together. So you you called Marcel the other day, yesterday, about the uh, insulation. What happened yeah. with that? What happened? Last time we've been there, yeah. remember? Yeah. It was 200 a piece. I think so, something like that, yeah. Now it's 300. Ah. They saw my face, ah. go up the price. Yeah, I have somebody else go get it. Yeah. Four inch. What did it write on the, on the board, all the prices? Four by eight? It's a one inch. Thick. And oh, sheets. God, you can get four inch. Where? You know where to get it, Cole? You know where? They had it in town at... Uh, um, what, well, Taliban? Yeah. Where? Uh, behind, behind the market? market? Yeah, behind the market there. Yeah, that's what we mean. They had the one inch, two inch, and the four. They had yeah. four inch. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think when me and Mitch were there, they had three quarter, one, and one and a half, yeah? Once they saw my face, the second time. Yeah, because we went by there oh. about 10 days ago. Oh, and when Maricel asked, it was 200 pesos. Yeah. When I was the other day, 300 pesos. Same stuff, same thing. See, I like the guy there behind the market there because they know us and that, and he'll actually pull out the sheet and show you on the sheet what it costs. So yeah. everybody pays the same price. Yeah, did you talk to the girls in there or they were the old man? In back of the one girl was so tough, and the, the old man just agreed. Huh. Well, you know, just agreed. Yeah, well, here's what it is. Yeah, so that's where you're going to put the uh, air conditioning unit yeah. there? Yeah, I measure, I make the frame, double double frame, yeah. angle, angle. Well, angle. when you get ready to put that in there, I'll come over and work my magic for you. Uh-huh. I got the timer. You got a timer? I got the, 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 the thermostat stuff, so okay. we can hook that up. All right. And so I done this frame, double, and I join it together, exactly for the size. You can see them joined in yeah, together, yeah, yeah. two frames, so it will be stuffed. Very fancy. Yeah, and uh, the hollow blocks just go in, go in, go in, and it's going to be strong stuff. Yeah, move. solid, yeah. Solid, so, because it's a bit heavy. So that, that, I put that to the door, so I can have a nice, nice place. And you're going to build a double door, right? You're going to make a, a yeah, separate entry actually, out here? Yeah, I'm going to come up a bit to here, about half a meter. So I'm gonna open this door, get in, shut the door, then open this one. Gotcha. Because the heat in here is so tough, so hard, I'm gonna destroy yeah. the, the freezer That'll side. help a lot. Now let's, get, let's show you the rendering I done yesterday. <coughs> Look at that. I cut, I cut two pieces of wood, two centimeters thick, I put them as a guide, one day, one day, then I have my tool over there. So how thick is the wood? Two centimeters, that doesn't, two centimeters. That doesn't mean anything to me. What are you talking about? Inch, quarter inch, well, half well, inch. I don't know, maybe one and a half. This thick? That thickness right there. Yeah, something like that, yeah. Ah, so, so three this quarters is, of an this inch. This is uh, one, because I got the machine, I got the... Bzzz, oh, that sprays, the sprays on? The ah. So once you do it, you just go like that and just take it out, right? So how long did it take you to do that wall? Yesterday. No, how long did it take you spraying it on? About two hours. Two hours? Yeah. Yeah, because you go up and down, up and down. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. So yeah, that's about, I'd say, yeah, a good three quarters of an inch thick. Mm. So you're going to do that all the way around? All around. All yep. around. Yeah. Seal it up nice? Yeah. And then now I leave it to... 
So now I do more fine sand. Yeah. Fine mix. Yeah. So Most, mostly cement. The, yeah. The nice finish. And then you're gonna paint it to really seal it. Paint it, or if I find the uh, uh, styrofoam, I stick it on. There you go. I stick the styrofoam on, so it's gonna be more thick and more isolated. Yeah. Yeah. So beautiful. That's what I done yesterday. Your so thing of it is, if you stick the again. styrofoam on, the heat will never get to the brick. See, the one thing about right. the brick, you heat the brick up, it takes hours it to becomes, cool down. It becomes like an oven. Yeah. Yeah. Get the point of uh, styrofoam. And you put the styrofoam on. Yeah, you want to keep cold meat in it, not baked bread in it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, or spoiled bread. Yeah. yeah. And this one is just on Nile, so I'm gonna take it out and just fill this up and use the same thing with the other side, all around. Guy. How are you going to attach the styrofoam? With the uh, with the uh, uh, tail mixture, tail cement. Ta oh, grout. Yeah. Grout. Yeah. yeah. Tile. 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 Tile cement. Yeah. That's, that's tile cement. Yeah. yeah. You just put like, like a grout, like yeah. a, you so it kind of like it just glues it on. Yep. Yeah, it glues yeah. it on. Yeah. 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 But just uh, let's say one sheet. You just put three nails in it. Just in case, just bring three nails in there after you put the cement on, yeah. and you hold on to it. Just put what three? What do you think about three this? nails? What do you think it's about leaving the wood in it and nailed to the wood? Yeah, nailed to the wood. No, no, no. The wood is gonna come off. Yeah, but if you leave it on, you can nail to the wood. I don't want to. Okay. No, I don't want to, because it's the 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 stuff we've been doing back to Romania because it's so cold over there. I have my my wall. Half a meter thick. Half a meter? Half a meter <laughs> thick oh, wow. my wall. In so your house? I have isolation with the styrofoam this thick on the outside. This thick wow. sheets of isolation. And we put that uh, styrofoam on and then we put a, another cement on top of it. And then we finish with the color like... Uh, like grout. Like yeah. grout. It looks yeah. like this. Yeah, stucco. Yeah, we, we call it stucco. Yeah, we used to do it with the with the brush. Yeah, you dip it in the bucket and, and just, just throw it on there. Yeah, and it just make nice, nice yeah. looking. Yeah, it, it give it a color. It make, it hides a hides a hides many uh, <coughs> little flaws. Yeah, so it just all looks good. It looks good, and the styrofoam stay there perfectly. Yeah, and well, it's looking it. good. How deep is the floor? The floor is not that deep. I done the the the. The slab, actually the slab is right here. The slab is five centimeters thick. Five centimeters thick the slab. And another five centimeters thick, uh, thick uh, the roof. How much is And I bet that's heavy. Huh? But I'll bet that's heavy. Yeah, it's heavy, but, but it's good. So you can go up this way. Because you can't see. I've got kind of a reputation with ladders. No, just go up, I hold you. And film that up. He holds. Now look at the roof. Yeah. See? That does yeah. look good, Mitch. Yeah, it's all cement. It does, huh? Huh? Wow. It's concrete. Man, that just that makes me tired just looking at this. I mean, hefting all the buckets up here. <laughs> oh man. My that's what I've been doing. Oh. That's what I've been doing. Yeah, everyone was saying on the videos, looks like you lost weight. That's how, huh? Nah, mate. You're schluffing we work every time, 30 pound we bags of, or 30 pound buckets of cement up on this roof. All right, just to finish it off, we took about two, two of them. Two of them, we fill them up. Wow. All right, down I go. Have a look at the roof here. Yeah, you didn't put any rebar in it? Oh yeah, I make a mash of, a mash? of uh, 10 mil, 10 mil bars. Yeah, it looks real nice up there. And all tied up and tied up with the wire and stuff. Huh? Like it? Yeah. Good stuff, huh? And on top of that, on on top of that, I'm gonna put shit. Like uh, the roof, roof shit. So I'm gonna come up with the extra four by four, two by two. Yeah. On that, on the edge, yeah, of course. One is going to be the line, line up with the measurement, and the roof is going to be all the way. There 
there you go. Yeah. So the sun, you won't hit the concrete. It will bounce from the sheet. Are you gonna are you gonna it's paint gonna be a gap? Are you gonna paint the sheets white? No, just like that. Huh? Yeah, just like that. If you paint them white, it'll drop the surface temperature about 30 degrees. Yeah, but they won't heat the concrete. That's what I'm saying though, the white paint on the sheets. Even better. Even oh, better. Yeah. It'll reflect. I will, I will do that. Yeah, but the roof. Oh yeah, you're buffed. You're to, buffed up, Mitch. You know how much I put in there? And I have this plywood. See this plywood? That was a uh, uh, hold on to with nails. That my guide. Five centimeters thick when I put the, the all around. That's a lot of concrete to put on a roof. Wow. So that's a lot of work. Yeah, one bucket at a time. <laughs> one more, one more. Were you sore the next day? Might I'm so every day. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Even now, because yesterday, I mean, lifting, lifting five kilo, put it down. Maybe it's more than that. You know that the system you put the yeah. you spray. Yeah. Try to lift it up uh, on top of your head. It's like a chainsaw. On top of your head, just to do that. Yeah, it's like a chainsaw. And not just one. Yeah. A lot of buckets. So. This morning I was aching. <laughs> Last night my back was sore. Yeah, I I worked on the I worked on the kitchen, <coughs> rendering the kitchen wall of the Perry last Saturday. Man, he worked me like a dog. I mean, all day shoveling the cement, mixing it by hand, because he you know? carrying you it to him. Supports out of here. Yeah, it will come out on uh, Saturday. I leave it on uh, for a week. Really letting it cure up good, huh? Ten mil. Ten. Ten. It's all tied up with the wire, you know. And plus, it's got the sheets on. Plus, That's don't a lot forget. That's for two bikes. But two by two, this one will stay there. Only the, the legs. Yeah, now. yeah. So <coughs> this this one goes in there. It's already. Boy, oh, that's still a lot of weight. On. I could see it on two by fours. Two by twos is a lot of weight. Yeah, well, these two on by the, twos are really two by two. They're not inch and a half not, by <laughs> by three and a half. You got five mil, five centimeters here. You got six centimeters the other side. And the thing is with form bar because it's ridged. Uh, once it once it got cement around it, it's pretty much locked in. So no, uh, it is locked in because I think on a span like that, it wouldn't bow enough to this one to worry about. Off. This one never. Oh off. no no yeah because that that's a good idea for me because I leave that on so when I come with the Styrofoam, I just put it on and leave the gap here. Yeah. So this gap can be hit, but not inside. Yeah. That's because supported. the styrofoam will hold it. That's supported all the way out? On oh the yeah. Brick, on the wall? Yeah, all the way. Yeah. That was the No, all the way. Here, I got uh, one one piece of wood. From that to that, it's yeah. three by two on an on edge. Yeah. On edge, so I can give them a, a bit of slide. From yeah, the water structurally, to, I think it'll be fine. Yeah, yeah. But I done hole in the wood with the drill, and I put bars like this through the wood into the blocks, block, yeah. into the blocks. So all the way there and all the way there, every piece of wood is got a bar in it. Well, I think the next typhoon that comes through, you better run here. Yeah. Mine. <laughs> yeah. I run in the pond, mine is better. I cool off. Oh, in the pond? <laughs> yeah. I think it's going to go down to the well, That's looking good, Mitch. Yeah, so I'm going to have a bit of roof in here. When I get in, it doesn't run in. You know, a bit of roof. There you go. Yeah, like a hat. Well, all right, going to wrap this one up, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hard work is like